Well, Florence, this is our new home. What do you think? Too many trees? Well, we are in the woods. I'm sure we'll get used to it. Lily, have you finished unpacking yet? More boxes. <sighs> more fun than unpacking. I didn't know anybody lived up there. They don't. So, who's that then? got away from me a little, didn't it? That hat is so sweet! Ooh, is this your sledge? What kind of wood is that? How fast does it go? Can it do jumps? Mm. Mm. It's old, isn't it? It is not old. It's well used. Can I give it a try? Sorry, no time. We're on a big, important mission. Mission? Looked more like you were sledging. Hmm. <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you, too. Quick, Benjamin, think, what did it say? Um, um... Bag of something for Jemima Puddle Duck. A uh, bag of rain? Bag of grain. Something or other for Squirrel Nutkin. Looks like Happel Nugs. Um, hazelnuts. Oh, this is a disaster. How will we know what to buy? I remember the list. Sardines for Mr. Jeremy Fisher. A jar of snails for Old Brown. Wait, wait, wait. You can remember everything on the list? Yes. I'm rather good at remembering things. We need you. I mean, I suppose you could come with us. Yes, please. If you're not busy or... I don't know. You weren't very friendly before. I I'm sorry. Let's start again. I'm Peter and that's Benjamin. Hello. Would you help us? Please. Yeah, sure. Mm. Hi, Lily. What are you doing? Florence and I were just taking a nature walk. Yes, a nature walk. Great idea. What's that? Oh, this is my very own just-in-time pocket, like yours. You mean just-in-case pocket. Oh, <laughs> right. <laughs> anyway... It's got all kinds of useful stuff in it. Some string, uh, a clothes peg, and uh, this. Big, isn't it? I borrowed it from my dad. Wow. Ooh. Hmm. It uh, might be even better with some glass in it. Uh, here, why don't you use mine? Yours? Are you sure? Of course. Sharing is what true friends do. True friends. Come here, rabbit. Come on. Huh? <laughs> Wake me up and I'll have you for lunch. I didn't mean to wake you. It was an accident. <laughs> Hot bugger! <laughs> 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 That was close. It was fun. Who? <laughs> Want to go on an adventure? We're already on one. Look. Notice how it's shiny on top, but not on the bottom? Wow. No, I said adventure. Exactly. Today's adventure is a nature walk. A what? Yeah, you know, looking at leaves and trees and bugs. 
But Mr McGregor's garden is full of radishes right now, just waiting for us to... Hey, Lily, why is it greener around the edges? Because that's where the sunlight touched it. I know that for a fact. <sighs> OK, then. Nature walk it is. Yeah! Ooh, yeah. <laughs> wow! Oh, that's brilliant! <sighs> <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe it! Look! What? What is it? A secret tunnel? A hidden cave? <laughs> it's a ladybird that looks just like Florence. <sighs> I'm going to call him Lawrence and I'll carry him everywhere. Just like you do. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! I just wish this nature walk was a little more adventury. Wait for me! Now I've got you. Everyone, split up! Be back in the treehouse! <laughs> Come back here! Gotcha! You little... Ah! Whoa! Ha-ha! Oh. 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 <laughs> Take that! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Stanley, Louisa, did you see that? A rabbit beating that big fox! I saw. So brave. So clever. Take that, he said. I'm hungry, Albert. Can we go home now, please? All right, brother, let's go. Mice! Ah! Watch ah! out! <laughs> Come back here and be grabbed. <laughs> ah. Fresh peas, eh? Well, if I can't eat rabbits or mice, I'll just take these. <laughs> <gasps> Our peas! Our precious peas! What are we going to do? We've got to get them back. I'm too little to go up against a fox. Why don't we get someone bigger to do it? Someone brave and clever. A rabbit! This sounds like trouble. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> that was a lucky escape. <laughs> I bet Mr Todd's really angry. <laughs> brave brave rabbit. rabbit! I'm Albert Tittlemouse and this is my sister and brother, <laughs> Louisa and Stanley. <laughs> Who are you calling brave? You, brave rabbit. Mm. Me? Oh, I'm not really all that brave. But we saw you with that fox. When I fell over and... When you outsmarted him and got away. Outsmarted? Oh, yes, outsmarted him. You are a brave, smart, <laughs> hero rabbit. <laughs> yeah, I suppose I can handle myself. I bet you could do anything. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Would you help us, Hero Rabbit? Our peas have been stolen. No problem. Of course I'll help you. Oh. I'll get your peas back. Oh, my name's not Ben. Uh, Hero Rabbit. Hooray for Hero Rabbit! Hooray for Hero Rabbit! Wow! Hey, actually, this is kind of fun. Oh, tail feathers! <laughs> Quit, who? Uh oh, fun's over. I'll teach you for waking me up, you flying fluff ball! This is all your fault. If your kite was easier to steer, Benjamin could escape. If your kite was faster, old Brown would never catch him. <laughs> We have to separate the strings to bring him down. Uh, no, we've got to get him away from old Brown first. 
Yeah! <laughs> you can run, but you can't hide, little rabbit. Whoa! Knocking! Peter! Old Brown's after Benjamin! I know! And Mr. Todd's following him on the ground! Mr. Todd is after Benjamin too? You've got to help us, Nuckin! Against Old Brown and Mr. Todd? I'd rather lose my tail. Again? No way! There is nothing, nothing you can say to change my mind. Uh, we'll let you fly a kite later. <gasps> Let's do this! Great! Come on, hop to it! Squirrels don't hop. Ouch! Oh! Ouchie! Ow! It's up to knock it now. What a sneaky thing to do. I must tell them how impressed I am. Just before I eat them. Thanks, Lily. That feels a lot better now. How did you get so good at doing bandages? I just practiced. Practice makes perfect. I know that for a fact. It's no good. There's no other way out. Looks like we're going back the way we came. But what if we get lost again? There are so many tunnels. Don't worry, Benjamin. That's why I brought this. This is no place to bring your knitting. Don't worry, I have a backup plan. Show us the way home, Florence. Uh-oh. Is there a backup plan for the backup plan? Oh, I know how we can get out. Peter will dig us a tunnel, won't you, Peter? <sighs> There's something you should know. I can't dig tunnels. <gasps> I can't believe you never told us, Peter. I thought you were good at everything. Sorry, Dad never got around to showing me how. Well then, it's time you learned. Copy me. Left, left, left. Left, 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 left. left. Right. Right. Right, 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 right. Ow! Oh, it's no good. I can't tunnel with one paw. A good rabbit never gives up. I, I know I can work this out. <laughs> wow. What? Have you found something about tunneling? Huh? Uh, no, sorry. I was just reading about your dad. He was such an adventurer. Yep, he was one of a kind. Always did things his way. And that's what I have to do. Do this my way. Like using that to dig our tunnel. Give me a hand. Ow! Yes! Well, it's not pretty, but it's working. Come on, you two. Let's dig. Off 
you go No time to lose, you best be on your way Proceed with care, think fast and stay aware And you'll succeed at what you're trying to do So off you go, and you should know The golden reach is waiting there for you I found my way to Dick, yeah! Rabbit? You're a... You're a, a... What are you? You've never seen a shrew before? I'll have you know, I am the tiniest creature in the forest. Like a mouse, but smaller. You may be small, but you're still a bully. You cut the road bridge and you push those rocks. So what if I did? Those dandelions are mine. not true. They belong to everyone. Flopsy was right. You are me. You're the worst, most horrible shrew ever. <laughs> you should learn to share. Yeah, yeah. Yes, Cottontail. Sharing is a good thing. Nonsense. I'll never share them. Never. We should have stuck together. We should always stick together. What would Peter do? We'll just have to go after them. You're right. We have to go after them. <gasps> Peter! Cottontail! What happened? Are you okay? D did you see his face? What did the fierce bad rabbit look like? Well, he wasn't a rabbit after all. He was a... Shrew! A shrew? Like a mouse, only smaller. So, what else happened? I'll tell you all on the way home. Oh, yeah. oh. Monkey with a tool belt. Wazzy, sound the octo alert. Octonauts, to the launch bay. And got it. 